Come ride the little train that is rolling down the tracks to the junction. Forget about your cares, it is time to relax at the junction. Lots of curves, you bet, and even more when you get to the junction. Petticoat Junction. There's a little hotel called the Shady Rest at the junction. Hey, good morning. Back with you again, I got Caesar the Road Dog. Hey, Caesar. What do you say? Anyway, we're here at the side of Shenango Road, outside of New London. We got a Wheeling Lake Erie coming here. And his destination is going to be Cary. So, this is going to be kind of an interesting day. <laughs> I'm going to try to catch him in Chatfield crossing the diamonds down there. But, anyway, as I approach there, uh, <coughs> He's coming right here, so now whether he stops here to get the clear to get on the CSX so to head down to their other branch line, it's hard to say. Or does he keep going? Let's see what happens. I have no idea what local this is. He's probably gonna pass by here. He's, this is kind of a shorty. And this is 5413. This is the real Grande. I think these real Grandes, they not, might need to give it a makeup job here. They're getting a little weathered here over the years. And it looks like we got liquefied petroleum. Okay, and there he goes. <laughs> all right. It's probably going to be off of the races today, so. All right. We'll be right okay, back. Okay, well, came down here on the, by the bridge here, by Railroad Street. This whaling that crossed over here a little bit ago. Here he comes. Got the green light to head on to the main here. Also, these workers getting ready to do some uh, tamping here, too, this morning, around the switch or so.
Okay, well, there she goes. So, all right. We're going to head on down the line and see if we can catch them again somewhere and see what other action. So, we'll be right back. Boy, oh boy. <laughs> About missed him. Anyway, I'm going to attempt to follow that uh, Rio Grande down by Chatfield. But I made a boo-boo here. I made a wrong turn. <laughs> I ended up over here. Go figure, you know. <laughs> I have a feeling I ain't gonna make it. Anyway, that's the idea. I was going to try to see if I could intercept him crossing Norfolk at Ch uh, Chatfield. So, there's still an outside chance I might be able to get there. Sorry about the dirty windows, though, but it happens. And if I'm not mistaken, this is Township uh, Town Road 187, I believe. Yeah, I goofed it. I wanted to turn the other way behind me. Okay, here comes the end. Here she goes. Okay, we'll be right back. Buzzards? <laughs> Buzzards. Over there. <laughs> <laughs> Got some buzzards over here. <laughs> That's what he's barking at. <laughs> get him. You gonna get him? <laughs> oh, okay, Caesar. I can't let you out out there. You might get run over by a train. Okay. <laughs> we'll be right back. We're in here, chat field, so. I think uh, that Wheeling Lake Gary uh, eluded me again. <laughs> but we're going to see what we catch on Norfolk. So we'll be right back. Okay, well, back at you again. We do have an eastbound Norfolk Southern. This is 28N, originated in Chicago, Illinois, and heading to Charlotte, North Carolina.
Okay, there goes that one. <laughs> yeah, I think that Wheeling Lake Erie got away from me, though. Uh, I think that boo-boo uh, was the boo-boo of the day when I made that wrong turn. I probably could have had a chance to get him here, though. But Hey, there's an outside chance maybe he's held up between here and where I was last. Uh, who knows? Maybe he'll come back from the other way if he did pass, so... All right, we'll be right back. See if we catch hey, some more. Back at you again. You know, here at Chatfield. Got an east bounder. No, this is a west bounder. Looks like Union Pacific. Let's take a look see what we got. Definitely intermodal. train number on this either though I didn't hear it what we got here it is a type of poison It's some kind of a fish poison. No hazmat number. One of them had a flammable, but it couldn't read it. Here's Mark. There she goes. Wow. Yeah, that was some kind of a poison in there because it had a sticker on there signifying uh, poisonous of fish. So, okay, we'll be back to see what else. I think we got another westbounder following this one. So, we'll be right back. Quickie update there. That train that previously went by was 276. It came from Norfolk, Virginia, and it's heading to Chicago, Illinois pass that along I think I might have an east bounder we're gonna see what we get hey, back at you again forgot to put my hat back on I was sitting in the car <laughs> got another uh, west bounder coming here that's our other one I mentioned earlier but here he comes and it looks like we're gonna have a little bit of everything that manifest, I guess they call it.
and there she goes. <laughs> okay, uh, I didn't get an ID on that train at all, but one before that one, though, uh, was uh, 276. Came from uh, Norfolk, uh, Virginia, and it's heading to Detroit, that previous one. If I get an update on what that was, I'll uh, let you know. I thought it might have been 273, which also came to Norfolk, but I think he's already long gone. But I don't know, I'm walking up here, I hear the radio traffic. He probably announced it while I was out. <laughs> All right, I guess what? I think I'm going to head over. Nineteen W. I'm gonna look it up. All right, I'm gonna go to lunch uh, over at Attica, and we'll be right back. Real quick though, that train that went by, uh, it was indeed two seventy six. I don't know where I got nineteen W though. Maybe there's one heading this way, but it originated from uh, Norfolk, Virginia, and it's head heading to Lander's Yard in Chicago, Illinois. So, all right, I am going to get some lunch. We'll be back in a back little while. Back at you again. Just got back from my attic. Got to get my food. Beat this up here. Canadian National. <laughs> yeah, coming back here from Attica, though, I was racing them side by side down Route 4, and I did beat them here. Anyway, I got to go back and get my food before Caesar might decide to confiscate it from me. <laughs> by the way, there was a 19W, though. Uh, he went by me as I was going to Attica, though. This train, I have no idea what it was, so maybe I'll find out. All right, we'll yeah. be back. Got a maintainer guy coming down here. I heard him earlier though. He was getting on here. So, anyway, checking things out. Got a bag of chips out of there. <laughs> I bet he has to probably get off these tracks. <laughs> Looks like he's hightailing it out of here. <laughs> Alright, we'll see what happens. We'll be right back. Okay, here we go again. Be here at Attica Junction, so I am.
Take me haul and coal this time. There it goes. Okay, well, got another North Fork though. I left the Chatham area though because there's a bunch of workers down there and uh, what I made a comment, uh, don't like you being here. Kinda grouch guy though. I respect it and left. Although, we do have a CSX over here. Right down there. So when he's ready to go, and we'll uh, catch him when he comes by. So, all righty, we'll be right back when he's ready to proceed. Hey, okay, matter of moments after that last train, here he comes. So let's take a look. Gotta get the power revved up there real quick.
<laughs> Look like pieces parts. <laughs> We got here 18 phosphoric acid 1805 maybe lobsters in there in the refrigerator cars <laughs> Liquefied petroleum, 1075. That's not vinyl chloride. I always keep an eye on these weird looking gray cars. Carbon dioxide.
Okay, and there she goes. <laughs> All right, uh, we're gonna mosey on probably closer into Willard though and see what else we can catch over there. But... All right, we'll be back in a little while. Okay, back at you again. No sooner I left the Attica Junction back here though, uh, down here at State Route 4. Got a westbounder coming. like either coal or coke this time. I didn't get an ID number. down there. Yeah, I was about to turn down this road though when I seen these, well I see one yellow light still shining here, so I don't know. Maybe there's another one coming. I gotta find a place for Caesar to do a nature call, so we'll see what else we can catch with your hey, right back yeah. at you again. This time we'll be on County Road 12, I believe here, right at the Attica Fairgrounds. <laughs> yeah, we've got a train coming here, so let's see what we got. Seventy ethanol. Twelve sixty eight. Eight 
1930, sulfuric acid. 2057. I think it's possibly styrene. We had some liquefied petroleum. One thousand five inhalation hazard. Uh, that's a different one. More the same, the petroleum, Vienna sausage cars. Denatured alcohol. Nothing listed. The PO on the end. There she goes. Okay. <laughs> well, that's going to conclude it for today. Hope you're going to enjoy the video when it's put together, though. But bear in this mind, always look and listen at these crosses, though. Sometimes these gates may malfunction. Train gets a second uh, chance. You don't. Always look and listen. You ever get your car stuck on the tracks here? Uh, blue sign right there. Call that number immediately. Get everybody out of the car. Hey, though, and call that sign. It's a direct pathway to the railroad. There's always a workers around somewhere, like I've seen numerous all over today. Again, 911 is sometimes too delayed. Try not to get the cops involved because they're just going to turn around with you, jail you, steal your money, and blah, 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 blah. Probably take your car, though, and auction it off somewhere. That's what they want to do. You may not see your car ever again. That happens. <laughs> With that, though, uh, check out the Railroad Tie Spikers channel, though. Uh, check out Northern Ohio Railroad Action uh, from Bellevue, Ohio. He's got some pretty good videos there, too. Uh, Elliot Walcott, Try Goglin, uh, and another rail fan I met around here, too. I think it's uh, Galen Costello. I may have got it right this time. He's around here, too. He's got a few videos, too, to check out, too. So check it out. Busted Boy 2, uh, CCR, or CRRX, that's railroading with Dave, I forgot the 6700, sorry Dave, <laughs> finally check out uh, Drop 2 the Hobo Shoe String though, and give a thumbs up for the Battle Weather the Railroad to keep America moving, we'll see you on the next one. And that's Uncle Joe, he's a moving kind of slow at the junction. Petticoat Junction.